what does it mean to fear God? To fear God, one, to take the words of the Lord Almighty serious because you recognize that the Lord Almighty has the power to control all the circumstances that surround you and that he has the power to make things and realities snap when you decide to let go of certain principles. Too much of a short sentence, a long sentence for the word taqwa. Just to think of the idea. And this is extremely important because what usually people don't recognize is that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, when you make a sin, he will not punish you right away, or at least the, the impact of that sin won't come to you right away. Same thing when we're talking about a good deed. Sometimes a good deed, you will get the reward right away in this dunya. And sometimes you will get it later. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, when he tells us, rabbakum, it's basically taking in a consideration that the Lord Almighty rules everything and watches everything. In other words, you can run, but you can't hide from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You cannot hide from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Why? Because he's kana alaykum raqiba. Raqib actually means to be in complete supervision. He's scrutinizing everything. Is Everything is under his watch. Everything is under his scrutiny. Everything is under his sight. When you look at the raqib, the raqib is usually a person that stands up high and is watching everything. So kind of like a bird's eye. Is capable of seeing everything. This is a raqib. A taqu rabbakum, where you're considering, okay, what should I do and have taqwa in? That's what we're going to get to.